Tumblr. It's going to die real soon. But why, you may ask? Some of you guys may not know. Tumblr decided to give the axe to all, quote, adult content on the site. Let's take a look at some excerpts from the post from staff themselves. Since its founding in 2007, Tumblr has always been a place for wide open, creative self-expression at the heart of community and culture. So what is changing? Posts that contain adult content will no longer be allowed on Tumblr, and we've updated our community guidelines to reflect this policy change. We recognize Tumblr is also a place to speak freely about topics like art, sex positivity, your relationships, your sexuality, and your personal journey. Bottom line, there are no shortages of site on the internet that features adult content. We'll leave it to them and focus our efforts on creating the most welcoming environment possible for our community. We're relying on automated tools to identify adult content and humans to help train and keep our systems in check. We know that there will be mistakes, but we've done our best to create and enforce a policy that acknowledges the breadth of expression we see in the community. Jeff DiGiorno's De 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 Pizza? Jeff DiGiorno's Pizza? How do you say his last name? You know guys, I think this might actually be a good thing. As part of the Christian Moms Against the Internet group on Facebook, thank God Tumblr is finally getting rid of this abhorrent content. It's, it's finally good to see somebody taking charge and thinking of the children. Thank you Tumblr for giving us the finger and literally telling us to go to other sites instead. I can feel safe at night knowing that the same bots that patrol YouTube endlessly and demonetize horrible, thought-provoking videos are the same ones keeping Tumblr a safe and welcoming community to Nazis all around the world. Am I glad I'm easily able to find Nazi-related content and connect with fellow Reich blurs all around the world? Am I sure glad that I'm not able to find any more adult content because pff, who wants to see that? Thank you, Tumblr, for allowing literal Nazis to roam on their platform while Staff parades himself as a, quote, welcoming community. Jokes aside, like, is this even real? Like, why would you draw this? Why? Thank you, Tumblr, for flagging this post to Garfield. Garfield is definitely something evil. It's good to see somebody thinking of the children. Thank you, Tumblr, for flagging this evil, evil drawings of mountains off your safe, welcoming platform for everybody including Nazis. I can rest easy knowing that nobody else will see this drawing now. Small artists never deserve to get their work recognized. Thank you, Tumblr, for flagging this anime off my feed. To be fair, anime is just trash, I'm just kidding. It's good to see Tumblr is keeping us users safe from the weeaboos. See you, Tumblr. You are a shining example of everything that the internet should be. Thank you for standing up. Thank you. It's truly American because it's truly stupid. Jokes aside, let's talk about Tumblr. I'm actually appalled that Tumblr had the audacity to tell us that there are no shortages of site on the internet that features adult content. It's extremely hypocritical that you ask one of the biggest sources of traffic on your website and then freak out because of one issue you face and then parade yourself as a welcoming community. Like why do people like these get a free pass on your site? You know, it was extremely easy to find this stuff on your site, Tumblr. It's not just this Nazi crap that I found. It also turns out there's a whole sub-community on Tumblr that worships the Columbine shooters. How is this allowed? Now imagine being so boring as a person that you worship school shooters. Needless to say, the bot that they're using to flag posts are trash. I found unflagged adult content, no I'm not showing it, while well, innocent artists get their safe for work art flagged. Even stuff unrelated to art gets flagged. This is a gif of a dog. It's a dog. Oh, that's one for the doggo cat. You know, lots of people rely on this platform for their jobs and communities, and it's not really fair to them that they get punished by a welcoming environment, while Nazis and school shooter worshippers don't get punished at all. You know, if Tumblr decides to go through with this policy change, I think their site deserves to die off. Tumblr, please, man to man, you and me. I need to finna bust a nut. Everybody, it's December, Yefmis is coming on December 25. We need to save Yefmis. Please, I need to nut. Guys, please tag Tumblr staff with this video and let's save Yefmis. Thank you. Finna bust a nut. 